In 1941, a man named Jim Rayburn started Young Life in Gainesville, Texas. He felt like every kid deserves an opportunity to make an educated decision about who Jesus is. And he went about this by using the avenues of relationship, adventure, and fun. Since then, Young Life has grown to be in every state in the U.S. and in over 100 countries worldwide. So what does this look like in Baltimore County? Well, let's start by meeting our Young Life leaders. Our Young Life leaders are adults, college-aged and older, who volunteer their time and have committed themselves to leading at one of the local high schools, middle schools, or colleges in Baltimore County. At every school we have Young Life in, there's a team of up to six adult leaders who are committed to building relationships and caring for kids. In Baltimore, we have Young Life in three high schools, Delaney, Hereford, and Towson. Our middle school programs we call Wildlife, and we have that in two schools, Ridgely and Cockeysville. We also have Young Life College at Towson University. And lastly, we have Young Life for Kids with Disabilities, and we call that Capernaum. In Young Life, we believe that no matter how great our events are, what really makes an impact in a kid's life is relationships. That's why the most important part of being a Young Life leader is something we call contact work. Contact work is when our leaders enter into the world of kids. They show up to sports games, plays, concerts, their tutors or substitute teachers, their coaches or chaperones on field trips. It can look a million different ways, but leaders building relationships with kids is what makes Young Life powerful and effective. Now spending time with kids is the most important thing we do, but it isn't the only thing we do. We have two weekly meetings at every school we have Young Life in. The first meeting we have is called Campaigners. This is where kids can come learn about who God is, what it means to have a relationship with Him, and how that impacts the way we live and treat other people. The second meeting we have is something we call club. Now this is where things get a little crazy. Like club, we're always hoping that kids will come in and feel loved and cared for in a way that's different than anywhere else they go, and that that would be a way to experience Jesus' love for them. My first time at a Young Life Club was so much fun with all the new people and all the new friends to meet. Um, I wanted to bring my friends to meet them too. My favorite thing about Young Life Club is getting to make relationships with people that are a lot more stable than the ones at school and just being able to hang out with people that I can count on. I think, you know, the best part about Young Life College is that people come to college thinking that, you know, you're supposed to have, you know, you're supposed to have fun partying and going out and stuff like that. You can still have fun, you know, doing it the right way, you know, strengthening a relationship. That's the most important that's our relationship with God. At Capernaum Club, we play games, we do skits, and we talk about God. I would say one of my favorite things about Young Life Club is the fact that it's just a safe environment to bring kids to and a great place for them to hear about God. And that is what hundreds of kids are experiencing every week across Baltimore County. The last piece of Young Life is the cherry on top, and that is when we take kids away for a week they will never forget at one of our Young Life camps. Camp is fun and it's exciting and it's adventurous and ultimately it's a reflection of what living a life with Christ looks like. I remember my first time at camp, I felt like I couldn't even believe that it was real um, and the fun stuff that I got to do with the people that I was with who wanted me to be there. I think Capernaum Camp is one of the best experiences you can be a part of. I think it shows the gospel in a different way. Just seeing all of our kids over camp of different disabilities and different capabilities, just um, enjoying themselves and having fun. It all starts with leaders building relationships with kids 
in hopes that one day they might understand just how much God loves them.